Borussia Mönchengladbach were desperately seeking an end to a barren run of eight Bundesliga matches without a victory. Mainz were also hoping to return to winning ways after two straight losses in the league. Gladbach looked visibly nervous in the early stages, despite having plenty of the ball. Andre Hahn was named in the starting eleven, despite no league goal since the opening game against Leverkusen. His effort didn't improve the feel-good factor at the Borussia Park. Raphael was in his customary position, but no two ways about it, Andre Schubert was a coach under pressure. Mainz without suspended Colombian striker John Cordoba used the Austrian Karim Onisiwo in the centre-forward position. And he had a bit of success, troubling Gladbach at times. Unsurprisingly, Yunus Mali was at the hub of most things creative for the visitors. First half chances in short supply though, and it was hard to put a positive spin on the proceedings. The big moment for Gladbach arrived in the second half. An element of good fortune as the ball fell for Andreas Christensen. The Dane slotted home his first Bundesliga goal of the campaign. Torgan Azar, who had replaced Hahn at the break, took the corner. Mainz put everything into the search for an equaliser and thought they had it with two minutes left. Aaron Zeidel with a fierce shot and Pablo de Blasis beating Jan Sommer on the line. The celebrations were in full swing. But referee Robert Hartmann felt the Argentinian had fouled Zoma. A controversial moment. Mainz thought the goal should have stood. Things got worse for the visitors when Jean-Philippe Gebema received his second yellow card for a foul on Nico Schulz. No luck for Martin Schmidt's team at the Borussia Park. Gladbach held on to win their first Bundesliga triumph since the 24th of September. Delight for André Schubert.